We have new information this morning on a breaking story out of West Fargo. Several neighbors are now telling us that a young child was grazed by a bullet in a shooting that happened in a neighborhood with many young families. Now, as you can imagine, that has a lot of families this morning on edge and upset as police continue their investigation into what led up to that shooting. The Valley Today's Brian Sherrod, he joins us live from the scene with what we know at this hour. Good morning, Brian. And good morning, Jordan and Lisa. You know, this is the second shooting that's happened in West Fargo. And right now, this is at Parkway Drive and also at 9th Street West. This is also in the Aurora Elementary School area. Then a call came in right around 7 o'clock last night of a shooting in this area. And right at 36th Avenue West and Parkway Drive is where much of the area was closed off because of investigators being on scene. Now, one person was hit by gunfire and was rushed to the hospital. No word on their condition or any other details about what happened. West Fargo's shelter in place has ended after a few hours, but still a very active investigation. Now, the public encouraged to stay out of the area until further notice, and as of 2 this morning, the Cass County Jail roster does not show anyone booked on a gun-related charge. Now, West Fargo Police is asking if anyone has any information to reach out to them, and as of right now, we're not sure if the first shooting and on Sunday or the shooting last night is connected, but we are going to make sure to ask and dig into that. Brian Sherrod reporting live. This is a story that has a lot of people in that neighborhood uh, definitely on edge, worried about their own children, and we'll keep looking into it. Thank you for reporting live this morning.